by meteorologist Kathy Sabin. It is Monday. We're kicking off a week with relatively calm conditions, believe it or not. You wouldn't know it by looking at the satellite and radar, radar composite because that moisture coming in underneath the ridge looks like it's going to drop some heavy rain showers and scattered storms, but it's really all about the smoke and haze. And we're going to see that smoke and haze kind of ebb and flow today, depending upon what the winds are doing. High pressure is the dominant feature, storm tracks to the north, but with that moisture coming underneath the ridge, we have scattered storms over the mountains, a dry day along the front range, and then the winds may pull in a little more of that smoke and haze during the afternoon and evening. A few showers are possible around Kit Carson and Lamar. Scattered showers and storms over the western slope and I-70 corridor. Denver's dry and warm, partly sunny, mid-70s today. But again, areas of smoke and haze, and where we're seeing that dark blue is where we're seeing the worst of it. And I think by Tuesday, as winds increase out of the southwest, we'll see an improvement in the air quality. Today, storms with hail outside our forecast area, Oklahoma, Central Texas, and up over the Northern Plains State. So a little break from severe weather today and really not much rain in the forecast for the next 48 hours with temperatures trending seasonal or slightly above 76 in Denver, 80 Pueblo, 79 Grand Junction, a beautiful day in the foothills, and we're just monitoring the air quality this afternoon. Partly cloudy 76 areas of smoke today and a little bit of haze tonight. Some improvement on Tuesday and then we see a big jump in temperature as well. 80 Tuesday, mid 70s Wednesday. A pattern shift means better air, but also more moisture for thunderstorms. We've got those in the forecast Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Enjoy your day. Thanks so much for watching.